There's that three guys defending in the end zone. And a little jump ball. Erlacher got a hand on it. It was caught. It's a touchdown! The Chiefs got it on a ricochet! Chris Conte bats it out of the hands of Brian Erlacher into the waiting hands of Dexter McCluster. This is going to be a touchdown. That didn't work out very well for the Bears, although Brian Erlacher said postgame that he did what he's always done on Hail Mary's, bat it down. This was the first time anyone's ever caught one. Well, you know what you did, don't you, Erlacher? You inspired a top 10. And the greatest thing about number 10 is that because of it, Borat lives forever. I love Back in 1964, the Minnesota Vikings taking on the San Francisco 49ers. The Niners fumble the ball. Jim Marshall of the Vikes grabs it and runs it back 66 yards to the house. The only problem was it was the wrong house. He went the wrong way. San Fran gets two points for the safety. It was 15 successive seasons in the top division. And Mark Charles has done my word. Oh, what an embarrassment. I do not believe it. We have seen one of the craziest goals ever. Connolly fakes it. Totally fires it. Off the inside of the post. No! They call it a goal. I think McKay put it in his own net. That was right on me. You know, certainly didn't mean to put it in the <laughs> net. In the net, excuse me. Taken by Galliardi, swept it ahead for Ryan O'Reilly, too far in front. It rolls into the San Jose zone, poked by Murray to Boyle. Score! Oh my goodness! The Avs have won in overtime! I think the San Jose Sharks just threw it into their own net! They did! Eyes in the front again, another chance, and a big stop, and the puck's in! Law had it and dropped it! Patrick Waugh just got caught hot dogging. Believe me, he was going to give it the how do you do, and he dropped the puck. Suter into the zone. Centering pass, gloved out of midair by Bergevin. How long did he have that puck in his glove? Now the puck's in the net. The puck is in the net. Oh, he did. He did. He threw it right in his own goal. He threw it in his own net. Oh, my. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen that happen before. Wow. Chris Brass committed arguably the most humiliating own goal while attempting an overhead clearance. Brass kicks it off his own face before it ricocheted by a helpless keeper. Even worse, Brass broke his nose on the play. Well, that was Martin. He dropped it back and Cron take it down. A penalty. And the Wolves are going to get a power play. Here's Martin from in behind. Trying to slip it in front. Oh! way to have a seven game winning streak come to an end. Harrison now throws it in behind the net and goes to the bench as the flame stays on the fly. Oh, it's right in by Smith. He goes in the net. Smith putting up his own goaltender. Unbelievable. Oh my goodness. Smith cannot find a hole big enough to hide in. In the second. Skates to Ray Emery, and Ray Emery puts it in off his right skate. I know how Steve Smith feels. Gerard steps up, fires. This one's going to be batted to court. Touchdown! Oh my gosh! How did that happen? Oh, he oh, unbelievable! It was batted back into the arms of Mike Thomas, and the Jaguars have won it. Yes, this is next.